Hello everyone, we're back with the more IGMC222 entries. As always, I will do my spiel first. I play what I want, but feel free to make requests. I don't promise to be nice, but I will do my best not to be too mean. I'm not a judge, so my opinion is my own and biased. I will play as long as I feel like and drop it whenever I want. My, my audio is pretty shit and I have a terrible accent because I'm Spanish. And finally, you will feel my Twitter and submitted game, as stolen love and the forgotten promise, below. So if you have time, check it out and read it. Okay. We're midway through the Italian game section, <laughs> as was requested. We've done Ouroboros, uh, Dungeon Crawler, and we're gonna do Eraser now, and then we'll do Super Spectrum. Eraser is apparently uh, the shortest one, so we'll do that as a, like a mint aftertaste to get rid of the bulk of the long game. I already have it downloaded. No, not that one. And not this one. This one. Ready, eraser. Oh. oh, okay. By Michael Primo. New game. Uh, ooh. Uh, you might want to put the yes as the op the other option. The default option being yes is asking for trouble. <laughs> no. Am I awake? But most importantly, am I alive? Also, another thing, if you already have... I'm not sure if that's com intentional, but if you already have like a, a zone prepared, you might as well not have a window skin here. Your window skin can be your map, if that's the point. I'm not sure if it is. I don't remember anything about what happened last some minutes ago, like... Been re like being raised with someone but for the rest welcome my guests forgive me for my ramblings I was just telling someone a story about the course of Etheria a story about the order of people who form a second Jesus loud a secretary instructed humans and instructed humans collect erasers to raise for okay let me lower that a bit there we go you must collect erasers to raise or erase dead people and other forms of life on these days, unfortunately, the forest nerves started to curse and send... Oh, the grammar in here is a bit more problematic. To curse and sending souls to the corpses where they belong and now we are full of undeads spreading everywhere. Okay, I'm gonna make a note of that. This one needs an extra... Go... Needs a second check. Let's Forest Nerus spreads everywhere. Now it's your turn to go to the forest, deciding the fate of everyone. Make sure the forest will be healthy with raised humans. Raised human? Oh, you mean zombies, okay. Helping it and not erase mindlessly because that will leave the bad consequences. Same if you leave the forest to impure humans. Okay, leave the forest to impure humans. You never know what, who you will resurrect. You found a man stuck in the river. Since the energy of the erasers can be used openly to raise, can be used only to raise or erase, you manage to grab the man at a distance. As a reward, he will help you for the quest of helping Ethereum. You got a human, he will help the forest by giving you 1% health each day. Okay? After a while, you feel a particular undead. You check it out well and you declare him a poor soul worth to help stop him in his horrible course. What is better, raising this soul or sacrificing it? I don't know, what does sacrifice do? I don't know. Why is pause an option? This is a <laughs> what? <laughs> Raise it, sure. You decide to give the soul a second chance. He was incredulous and really grateful towards you. Every day he will help stopping the course of the forest, improving its life. You gain it for human. The undeads found a way to deal the most pain to the wall of Italia, poisoning the soil and, most importantly, the water. There's only no limit to the worst. You lost an amount of one human, getting a malus health each day. After a while, you find a particular undead. You check it out. Okay, it's the same one. 
I'm not, I don't understand. If it's good, why would I not get it? Oh no, never mind. He was. This person is really dumb. They wander the forest by my kids. That's scary of them. I guess you will pay for this. You told me that he was a pure soul. You fucker. Either he's pure or he's not. <laughs> When you are walking, you feel shivers and unnatural cold. You spotted a ghost near to your surroundings. You don't have any information and you don't have to stay focused. Ah, uh, pause the ghost. Okay, that's the option, <laughs> never mind. Ah, <laughs> uh, you, you skip this, by the way. I will say that some of the sound effects are a bit annoying. It didn't pull? Never mind, then I didn't. I thought it was the same block of text, so I didn't. You Oh, there's a there's a suggestion. 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 Uh, highlight the vital parts of each mini narration. Which has for you. Some blocks of text are really similar. So it's easy to think they are the same. Push to the map, sir. I'm not gonna fucking off with you. That's a joy, it's free land to borrow and subjugate as you will. The course makes really violent some sometimes, especially they get more angrier per day and for undead that is by you. I wonder if you will be with them surely. Okay, the, the translation on this one is kind of rough, I'm gonna say that. It really definitely needs work. It really does not help in this general. <laughs> the forest suffered an amount of five damage of health. After a while, check it well and you declare him impure. At this point, I, I have to wonder, if it's impure, why are you asking me what I should do with him? <laughs> with a cold head, after a half mile of pain, nothing but much to negative energy. Bad consequences of your actions have now improved. Okay. While you are walking, you face events of an unnatural cold. Spot a ghost, you have all have information. Sure, raise it, why not? They say to give the source of conscience. Ghost incredulous and what's like uh They cannot give anything. Every day in a theory can give him something and if you put him Okay. Back to the Um when you are walking, you feel shivers and unnatural cold. You spot the ghost near your surroundings. No, fuck off then. Feel shivers and unnatural cold. No. Ah. Uh, where's the gold of this game? <laughs> Check it well and you declare him impure. And fuck off. I'm I'm kind of lost. Am I supposed to be doing something else? Considering you told me that I have a bad chance. A 
four soul. There we go. No, fuck. <laughs> Son of a fuck. No, I'm not. Hmm. I, I, I have stuff to say, but I want to see if I can actually do something first. My main complaint so far is, is that there are too few events. There are way there are way too few events. And then and one and some completely random and others poorly bad. So it feels really I don't have any information. I don't have any information. Poor soul. There we go. Finally, please. Fucking style. Oh, finally. Jesus Christ. Okay, no. Sure, raise it. Why not? Emily, yay! <laughs> and I'm a... oh, are there no positive events? You lost an amount of 13 humans! Are you kidding me? What the fuck? What's happening? Oh, just fucking kill me already. I can't come back out of that, just sure. Sure, sure. Undeads vanish at the forest, expanding the course in a merely amount of time. Thanks to you, everything, even the Undeads will suffer more. The riser hit themselves because of the accusation of the people of the order they belong. So another eraser should defend this forest as soon as possible. I mean, is that really me? Here's my problem. Out of the events I had anything I could do with, there were like two of them. One was no information, yes or no, which is random. And the other is impure or impure, and the rest are automatic, yeah? I'm not sure how it's considering where to take you next, but I had that ton of bad events where they were like oh yeah you lost 13 humans you lost six humans like what am i supposed to do with that i have no clue of what the game is trying how is the game is balanced but that's not <laughs> and the the ghost event is so common what am i supposed to do with that i don't understand what you expect from me in that one like, I feel like this is so random, like, the ghost is literally, yes or no, heads or tails. Yeah, but does that, if that only happens if you rise, like, good people, right? What if it's a bad person, it just goes to fuck? Yeah, skip the fucking intro. Yeah, see? Like, now I get a good event in <laughs> this one. I didn't get any last time. Poor soul, fine, yes, raise it. Ah! Oh, now suddenly they're all positive, you fuck. <laughs> uh, suddenly I'm awash in positive events. 
I didn't fucking oh god I didn't fucking read what it was. Oh sure raise it, why not? See, I'm getting a ton of positive events now. It's like what? I didn't read again. God damn it, streamer brain. You raise it. Yeah, sure, it was good this time. Yeah, I really feel like you. I really feel like this game really needs a lot of streamlining and highlights on the important parts because it's continuously repeating text. It's very easy to phase out with this. Sure, raise it. Why not? Yeah, evil deeds. Okay, sure. No. Impure. All with you. A criminal, okay. Oh. I faced out again. God fucking damn it. Yeah, I'm getting a ton of landfalls here. Just like, yeah, sure, here, have some of this. Oh, uh, okay. Let me see if I can wind it and then I will just, yeah, I know, just raise everyone, why not? Like, I'm sorry, but it feels like the best strategy is just to raise everything. Who cares? Just raise everything. And all the positive of uh, this game is balanced very poorly. Okay, I will get in a moment. Impure, okay. Ah, sixteen health. Fuck you. Put me back for like five turns, come on. Sure, just raise everyone. Fuck off. Okay. Oh, so there we go. It's at hundred. Please end. Oh, thank God. The vanquish you vanquish the deaths of the forest, expelling the curse for now. Everything will suffer less with the heroic gesture. We hope the forest will not be cursed again for a long time. Hope you will help us again in this case. I'm gonna be honest. I did not like this. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try to elaborate and suggest some changes. Feel free to ignore me, obviously, it's not my game. But I have a lot of problems uh, with with this. Yeah. Right, let me start with the good things. Um, the visuals are cute and very sim simple. The uh, highly... I already said this, yeah. Uh, the structure, the structure is another idea of forging or Reviving with a small randomized event. Event by the But there is no second check on the text. What's this? Oh, yeah. The text in general, the text in general is a bit drop and needs a second draft. 
there are way way too few events i counted like what one negative event uh, no two negative events two positive events the ghost the pig and the nothing that's like what the seven events <laughs> you can do a few more come on <laughs> Like, I, uh, maybe this was done in, like, a week. I don't know, but uh, 10 events total, yeah, something like that. It's way too little for what the game expects you to be playing. Like, I, I feel like for how uh, oversimplified the events are, there's, like, two options, yeah? One, you have... I, I still feel like 10 is too little, but one, you have events with a lot of variables where you have a lot of options, or two, you have a lot of events that are very simple um the the rng is really crappy it can get really nasty the fact that um erasing or raising even the wrong souls has an effect on the rng is not properly conveyed yeah it's fine but i'm just telling what i will I, I i see in it you don't have to agree with me by the way i have my own takes on stuff what else uh the, um, the text sound the text beeping did get did get a bit annoying annoying um let's see all i can do is be like okay this is what i will do but that's not necessarily what you want so what i will do and feel free to ignore me three thousand percent is like if if the point of the game is like rise or delete or push uh first make it really clear what each of them does make sure that instead of that weird intro where it's like oh yeah uh but basically all you get is like, yeah, it's a forest and you're a racer, go. Instead of that, you should really introduce the fact that raising and, re and pushing have very specific uh, results. Specifically the one with the, that affects RNG. Another thing I will do is balance the RNG a little. But by adding, um, what you can do pretty easily with some work, eventing simply, is like uh i'm not sure if you've done this already it's like categorize um categorize your events by by type for example a positive event negative event neutral event and make the roles so that you cannot have too many and give them like a cooldown for example if you've got a negative event or may, or even i will try to maybe like give them tears so like you have a negative event which is will be like a, an impure soul and then the one where they burn some of the forest self and finally the one that, where they take like six or 14 fucking humans <laughs> same for the for the positive event same for the no chance so you have like uh, negative one two three positive one two three neutral one two three something like that and then uh, not really more like a balance so that not all the shit happens at once just to have a small not even like a pity system just a, have a cool down so that i can get fucked immediately like in in three turns <laughs> not even have and especially it kind of loses its weight i think making the decision when in practice all you really have to do to win is just raise everyone it kind of loses the it kind of loses the point i think or maybe the point if the point was that the the, the best thing to do is just revive everyone regardless of the situation then maybe you can you could you will have to give it a bit more context then have like more um like more more comments about that that the, the right move is to give everyone a second choice if that's the point the the, the game has to reflect it because the in the first time i played i did um i did not see any good outcome out of reviving people another thing that you can do it it's it's a bit more complex but another thing that you can do but will be like giving uh that's coming into more work area by the way i'm just shooting the shit at this point it will be like giving the player like at a certain checkpoints give them like new skills or choices 
For example, you have a skill to, for example, uh, tell you if a ghost is good or bad. You have a skill that if you see, um, or you're finding items, for example, you have an item that if you see, um, if you see, what's it called? Oh, God damn it. If you have an item, if you see uh, the event where the monsters are poisoning the water, you can intervene. If you have a, if you see a scene where you see the humans, you can give them an item and the bonus is even better. Something that gives the player more input because otherwise I felt like if the only options I have are yes or no, and one of them is clearly wrong and the other one is clearly right, I, I, I'm not doing anything. <laughs> I don't, I don't dislike the concept of having like a very short, random evented um, little thing. I don't dislike those kinds of games. But I did feel that this was very unsatisfying as it was. It's a, it's a cool premise, it's a cool base, but the execution does not really match it. Um, what else can I say? Yeah, def I will definitely try making more events or making the events have more variants. Uh, I will definitely try to make it so that the important parts of the text are highlighted because otherwise the text is too similar. The thing where I, I believe it was only like one or two words in the the, the entire uh, introduction of the... Um, welcome back, my kid. The entire introduction of the wall in poorer in poor soul is the same. It just it, it was very disconcerting. Also, if you're clicking ahead because all the events are being repeated, it's very easy to miss what was a poor and impure soul. Yeah. Yeah, it's fine. I think the base itself is cute. But it really needs more content. And, and, and a bit more polished. As it is now, it, I feel like it's like a prototype more than a game right now. Not in a bad way. It's ju it just needs work. This is what you show to your friends. And your friends are like, yeah, it's, it's cool. But it needs this, this. I feel like it needs that. It, it needs more. It needs a, it needs a second go on the oven. Cool concept, the execution is not really there yet. And I'm pretty sure you're bored of me lecturing you like I'm some fucking teacher, so let's go on to the next. Anyway, on to the next, which is Soul Spectrum. 